Where's Creep when you need him as a tour guide? Creep actually, when I went to New York, Creep actually showed me around, which is super cool that one of you guys was in New York. I remember, I remember being in New York and I'm like, dad, one of my viewers lives here. He wants to show me around. And my dad is like, son, they're going to kill you. And I'm like, dad, I don't think they're going to kill me. And they're going to be like, they're going to murder you. This is going to be a John Lennon situation. I'm like, the chances of my viewers stabbing me is pretty low. To be fair, I'm glad Creep didn't kill me. I, I really appreciate that Creep didn't stab me. He had the chance. He had the chance to stab me. I'm glad he didn't. Oh, this is the, this is the, this is the one building with, I, that looks stupid. Go to the restaurant in Steinfeld? I, oh, the restaurant from Seinfeld? Is that what you're trying to say? I would have John Lennoned you? I don't like, I don't like the sound of that. <gasps> hey, hey, hey. Ooh. This is so cool. Like you can go to New York and you can just like, do a person. A. It's the Mario building. I want to get high. I want to get high. I want to get high. Yeah! Okay. Let's see what we can see of New York. New York. Nurk. There's Central Park, which honestly does not have as many trees as I thought. Yeah, look at, look at how good those clouds look. Holy, is that a JPEG? Is that a JPEG? Those are some good looking clouds. Those are some good looking, that's gotta be a JPEG. That's, those aren't rendered. That's a freaking JPEG. There's no way that's not a JPEG. That's some good looking clouds. You pictured more water in Central Park? No, Central, Central Park's got like one lake and an ice rink, that's it. Down there you have New Jersey. Over there, you have a uh, Texas. Way down there, you have uh, the the Twin Towers. Uh, over there, you got Staten Island. There, you have Alcatraz. I don't know where the Statue of Liberty is. I don't see no damn Statue of Liberty. For all I know, there is no Statue of Liberty. I think it's down that way. I mean, if you guys can think of anything that's in New York, it's here. I just don't know where it is. Go to the Disney store? Where the hell is the Disney store? Oh, this is my favorite part of New York. It's the, the squirt fountain. I remember going to the squirt fountain. Yo, what's up? Nice to see you. They do not look enthused at all. Can you go to the gallows or the ghetto or the town in the meadow of the billows or over the sun every end time has another begun? The ruler of everything? Do you like how I walk? Do you like how I talk? Do you like how my face disintegrates in a chalk? Go to Bushwick and look at all the hipsters? No joke, my brother and I went to like a hipster milkshake store in New York and they charged us $30 for a milkshake, but it had a piece of cake in it. Hang on, let me see if I can pull it up real quick. I paid $30 for this milkshake. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this milkshake. You have milkshake, ice cream, and then an entire slice of birthday cake. All in one milkshake. I'm like, yo, I'll take uh, the birthday cake uh, milkshake. I didn't expect that it actually had birthday cake on it. I'm like, how the hell am I supposed to eat this? They, they didn't even give us a fork. I, I just had to bite into it. I just had to bite, I just had to bite into it. It was Times Square. Oh, that's me with creep. There's creep right there. There he is. There's creep creeping. Uh... I met Luigi in New York. I met Luigi. He's seen better days. I love how this costume is the most half-assed costume I've ever seen. Like, they're like, I don't want to get sued by Nintendo, so I can't make it too obvious. I paid $25 for a milkshake, but hot damn, it was amazing. It was a pecan milkshake with pecan pie in it. Oh my God. Luigi would give me a bill. Would this Luigi give you a bill? 
I met that one girl, I got a Kit Kat, I saw the statch, I went to Doctor Strange's house. Uh, Dio. I went to the Mario store and met Mario. I've already told this story, but you know what? I'm just gonna show it again. While I was at the Nintendo store, they had a life-size replica of the punching bag from Super Smash Brothers. And as I pointed out before, if you zoom in on the sandbag, you can notice a little detail, and that is that somebody freaking s <laughs> somebody smacked Somebody smacked the hell out of this sandbag. Like they walked up to it and they're like, it's my time to shine. And they just put their fist through it. <laughs> and Nintendo's just like, no one will notice. It just adds authenticity to it, I guess, that somebody actually punched this thing. I got a pizza, I got a JoJo salad. Yeah, New York was pretty good. New York was pretty neat. Here's my dad with uh, Danky Kang. I don't know if my dad knows who Danky Kang is. But yeah, the best part of New York, without a doubt, the best part of New York at the end of the trip was that I got to visit the E. In the middle of New York, there was literally just a giant E and I don't know why. I don't know why, but I took a photo of it. I was, I was really excited to see the E. I'm like, that's a good E. <laughs> it's not an E at all. It's an upside down nine. All right, moment of truth. Can Spider-Man swim? Yo, he can. No joke. I just thought he was going to die. I thought Spider-Man was just gonna like die like in most open world games, but here he is. He's just kind of, he's just kind of floating. This is the fastest you can swim. Imagine the people looking into the ocean and being like, huh, Spider-Man taking a dip. This water's probably filthy too. It's probably so much feces. I went to a Denver, Colorado and there was a big Lego head in an alleyway. You should have took it. Don't mind me, everybody. I'm Spider-Man. I'm Spider-Man. Don't mind me. I'm Spider-Man coming through. I want to I wanna show you what the boat people look like. Because they didn't think anybody would get there. Yeah, this is going to show it. You got to use photo mode. Oh, no. I think you just straight up made it. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. I don't like it. Why is it so realistic and so fake? Like, it looks so realistic, but it's like Minecraft people. <laughs> Oh, baby, PS2, here I come. They look different in the PS5 version? Is this Earth 616? No, this is its own Earth. However, the the suit that I'm wearing? The suit that I'm wearing? Oh, never mind, it's torn up. It's torn up. This suit looks like trash. This suit looks like trash. Never mind. I'll say, I'll say what I was going to say later. This is what they look like on PS5? I bet they look a lot better. They actually put little sticky notes on them because they knew people were going to do it. They're like, what should we do? A, fix the boat people, or B, attach a message to them. And they're like, let's just put a message on them. I'm sorry I'm late. I swear to God, if he loses it. <gasps> it's Dukuk. He started without me. The Grant Committee's director will be here soon. Bird Boy. I, I, I gave you, I gave you five million coins. Don't say goodbye. <laughs>
<laughs> I feel like I feel like I missed vital lore in a video called makes him poop himself and die. Why the hell is he making a masturbation robot? Oh, it's literally a masturbation robot. Um, maybe we should abort. Not yet. Hold on. I sure hope this event doesn't turn this man with a bunch of octopus tentacles on his back into some sort of octopus themed villain. Doubt it. Dr. Artavis, are you okay? It's Dr. Sense. Phil. <laughs> it's a surgical robot, but yeah, it can be used for masturbation. But we're close. He looks he looks just like how I'm gonna look in 30 years. It's straight up just what I'm gonna look like in 30 years. You know you want to give the bill. Is anyone hurt? No, it, it was all the, my fault. The energy levels exceeded our expectations. You mean five years? From a certain viewpoint, that's a very positive development. It doesn't. I want to lick. I want to lick this part of his head with I my mouth. In the next phase. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> he doesn't have boobs in this version. That's Spider Verse. Maybe you should take the rest of the day off, Peter. But we'll talk later. This is not Miles Morales. This is the original, but the remaster. What do I think of the 700 Club? Is that like a kinky thing or is that a TV show? Like, look at this. What do you think? What do you think they're going to use this hand for? What do you think that they're going to honestly use this hand? Shape, little guy. Coffee? Literally, this is all you can do. Oh! I just simultaneously whipped and nay nayed. It only has two functions. Stimulate and whip. <laughs> Those are the only two functions that this robot has. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, Dios. Oh, Dios mio. What have you done? What have you done? I can still turn off puzzles? I can literally just press a button and skip the puzzle. Nice. Okay. Nice. nice! I'm an idiot. Okay, how sexy is this arm now? Good as new. Oh. Oh. Doc's been testing new materials for the prosthetics. He asked me to review his work if I had time. May as well I'm a now. scientist. So my boss doesn't know that I'm Spider-Man. That's my secret identity. I you do you do this, and then you do this. And then you do this. Wow. Oh, man. I'm so smart. That's some hard science. Hydrogel polymer composite. Strong. But I should make Bird Boy work for his coins. I should, like, I should, like, make him write an essay about Egypt or France or how tuna exists of impedance. better tell doc to keep looking you know for make it materials. educational <laughs> he's like i finished the essay and i'm like it's not enough words i should get out of here before i screw things oh, up 500 words no double spacing this is a c minus at best write an essay about these nuts <laughs> we're trying to improve the prosthetics hardware I should review what Doc's been developing and double check his work. It's to help people with one arm? Oh, so if somebody loses their arm, they can get a robot arm. Can you get... 
Can you can you get an arm transplant? Cause you know how you can get a heart transplant or a kidney transplant? Can you get like can you like just have somebody give you their arm and they just like sew it onto your arm and you can control it? That's a real thing? Like you can actually put another human arm on your body? That doesn't make any sense. But I I live on through this arm! It's so if they lose their arm, they can still jerk off. That make you a cyborg. I'm not saying a robot arm. I'm saying, I'm saying I lost my arm in an accident. And then some guy off the street says, I hate my arm. And he cuts it off and scientists grab it onto my arm. So it looks like a normal human arm, but it's just mine. Is that real? I lost my arm in an accident, but I still want to go at it. Fisk make it to Rikers yet? Not Rikers. Our boy qualifies for the VIP treatment. He's in the raft. Ooh. Ah, joining Scorpion, Electro, and the rest. Fisk should be honored. That's a steamed company. Can you swing by the precinct? Got an issue that could benefit from your unique skill set. For you, Yuri, anything. Oh. I'm on my way. You can get a transplant for anything? What about penis? Like, you know how when you die, if you're an organ donor, they take your organs? Do they take your penis? So, like, if I, like, lose my penis in a fire, like I can Jason's get a new one. A new episode out. I wonder what my number one fan thinks about the Fisk takedown. It's with J. Jonah Jameson. <gasps> Alex like Jones! We discussed the issues affecting our city with Pulitzer Prize winning two-time. Two-time. Pulitzer Prize winning former publisher of the Daily Bugle. Hey, plug the book. And... And as always, if you order Mr. Jameson's book, Spider-Man, Threat, or Menace, within 24 hours of our it's podcast, Alex Jones. you'll get an autographed copy at no extra charge. No personalizations, don't ask, not gonna get it. Welcome to Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, alerting you to the threats you don't even know about. Let's dive right into the calls. Speak. Okay, so not for nothing, you gotta give Spider-Man respect for taking down Wilson Fisk, right? I mean, one last mob boss is good for everyone. Is that right? Tell me, are you a police officer? Prosecutor? Maybe an award-winning reporter with decades on the job like me? Uh, no, I'm a Do you guys agree with Jonah? Spider-Man's a criminal and deserves to be in prison. It's an alien conspiracy. Oh, good. Then fix my toilet and shut up! Let me explain something to you about crime bosses. As soon as one goes down, every punk with a gun, a tracksuit, and a drawer full of gold chains decides he's the next godfather. We're gonna have a gang war in the streets, but does that whip-headed moron give a damn? Of course not. He got on TV. That's what counts. <laughs> yeah, well, I can get copper pipe without paying kickbacks now. So until that gang war starts, I'm on the webhead side. And you'll be singing a different tune when three new mobs are lining up to charge you triple for that same pipe. Or just break your legs. Goodbye! Jameson is right! One day, Jonah, I'm gonna get you to say something nice about me. Someday. I love I love how this game turned J. Jonas Jameson from a newspaper salesman to just an angry podcaster. Like they're like, how many people still read newspapers? How many people would listen to an angry man with a podcast? You got your essay? Where the hell did I get an essay? Who the who the hell sent me an essay? Did so did somebody submit an actual essay? You DM'd me an essay. Okay, let me check. Let me check the essay. It just says peen 500 times. It, it, just, it just says peen 500 times. That's, that's, that's not, that's not an, that's not an, that's, that's the opposite of an essay. That's, that's the complete opposite of what an essay is supposed to be. I said it had to be a 500 edu- It had to be an educational essay about Egypt or tuna. This is just the word being 500 times. It's a sex ed course, but it doesn't teach me anything. If I walked into a sex ed class and the teacher just said penis 500 times, I'd be like, teacher, I don't understand what any of this means. It taught you about peen.
J. Jonah Jameson just gets on stage and says Peter Parker is Spider-Man. I mean, that's literally the last movie. What do you tell people when you come up here? That I need a break from their crap. Fair enough. So, why'd you call? Need a date to the policeman's ball? You got a black and white suit? Uh... Yeah. No ball this year anyway. We spent too much integrating Oscorp surveillance tech. Worth it though, right? It was. Until an hour ago. The system went down. Excuse me, where's the lobby? He's done all, and to the left. Thanks. Exactly how I remember it. He lied. Every tower. How? They tell me someone sabotaged the central server, and now all the towers are offline. Hmm. Inside job? Maybe. We'll figure it out later. Right now we need to get the towers back online. Fast. And you called me? Yeah, Lost? J.K. Simmons voices a lot of cool characters. I called someone I could trust. Plus, the signals are scrambled and we have no idea how to fix it. Ooh. I love a challenge. You break it, you buy it. I thought you trusted me. Has anybody seen the movie Whiplash? That's the movie with the guy and he has a drum and then J.K. Simmons, who you might know as J. Jonah Jameson, is sitting there with the cowbell and he's like, you got a drum! And then the guy's like, pa da 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 and he's like, no! It's a good movie. Who, anybody seen Whiplash? Let's I like that. It's one of my tower. favorite movies. Not just a pretty mask, huh? Whatever you did, any chance you could do it to the other towers? Sure, but just so you know, I had to sync up with the tower to fix it. I'm seeing all crime data in the area now. Looks like there's a break-in happening near me. Great. I've got units nearby. Don't bother. I'm on it. Do it. Does anybody use ski mask not for crimes? Because if any of you guys own a ski mask and you haven't committed a crime, I'm proud of you. They keep your face really warm, but like... Sure Anybody who buys dangerous. one, I'm going to whip that guy to the wall. <laughs> that work. I'm going to hit that guy with cardboard, which everybody knows hurts. Look at the ray tracing on these puddles. <clears throat> I mean, I assume that's what that is. When snow blowing into the wind. Duh. Thanks for that. Now I'm seeing an assault near you. You're in luck, Yuri. Your favorite tough but lovable grizzled scene too much detective is in town. What? No, 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 no. You promised you wouldn't do that any- Spider cop. Please, no. So you're the snitch. Back off, creep. Yep, she's the one. I said back off! She snitched? Leave me alone! See, she snitched on these poop lickers. Get away from she her. told everybody these guys lick poop. <laughs> sounds the same who voices Mitsuru. That's why her voice sounds familiar. People who can like hear a character and just know who that voice actor is. Like, I wish I had that power. Bear Grylls drinks pee, but he's never eaten poop? That's because I don't think there's a lot of, you know, nutritional value in feces. As opposed to urine, which, like, can actually help you survive. Oh, jeez. You wouldn't be playing Spider-Man if not for me. It's true. I, I gave you a million coins! I don't know how they disappeared that fast. To be fair, that gamble, you would have made eight billion. Walk away now, or she's dead. Let me go. Oh no. He's gonna shoot her. Not. I would have failed that quick time event if I didn't want to go through that whole fight again because I'm pretty sure if you fail that quick time event, you hear the gunshot and Spider-Man just goes, ah! Like he just looks really disappointed. Like it's not like shock. It's not like, oh, it's like just disappointment. He's like, oh, dang it. Have you got somewhere to go? 
I can take care of myself. I I'm sure you can, but just in case, there's a place called the Feast Center. Seen it. I don't want charity. They got the best wheat cakes in the city, hands down. Mom used to make those. <laughs> She's like, I don't want your damn food. I can handle myself. And Spider-Man's like, wheat cakes. And she's like, she starts salivating. She's like, I haven't had any wheat cakes. In a long time. What the hell is a wheat I'll cake? Thanks, Spider Guy. Wh what? Spider what in the piss is a wheat cake? That, that's that's the worst thing I've ever seen. That's the worst thing I've ever seen. This is a wheat cake. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just some bread on a napkin. Somebody's like, I whipped up some wheat cakes, and they just slap this in front of you. Cabbage pancakes. These are pancakes made out of cabbage. That's the worst thing I've ever heard. Guys, I want you to write me an essay one word at a time. I want everybody to write one word and turn it into an essay. So just post one word at a time and make a legitimate essay. And if I approve of this essay, you owe me I ate what bill I you Casey sex, Shay O, bird sex sex, one thief sex phone, sex billion, of sex sex coins, sex gender sex he, sex 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 sex, hi, sex deserves sex, is sex sex, it sex sex butthole, so sex nice sex 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 much, sex 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 sex, sex has sex sex good sex bird tings sex does not sex need one billion i will kill meme school sex you money because finished according money that's you guys failed the task are you narrating yourself what no of course not the chief never did understand spider cop thought he was a loose cannon already regretting this i can't believe spider-man has become the police it's 2021 i don't want i don't want people to dm me and just say the game if i can modify these I'm gonna kick to your ass and just crimes yeah. the game I've been dealing with the game since I was like 12 years old. I've been doing good for like eight months. Score. Towers are picking up all kinds of RFID signals now, including one nearby. Does anybody here not know about the game? Because if I can just teach one person about the game a year, then I feel like I'm dooming them to a lifetime of suffering. What is that? Because most people know about the game. But there's always one person who's like, what's the game? And I'm like, you've never heard of the game? Eight billion. Is this the remastered? This is the remastered one on PS5, yes. You wrote your essay? I saw it, you just said the game. I'm going to destroy you. What is the game? Okay, well, real quick, you're now playing it. You're now playing the game. You have signed up to play the game. And the game is you have to not think about the game and not read about the game and not talk about the game because if you do, you lose and you start over. And the longer you go without thinking about it or hearing about it is your score. And if at any moment you think about the game or are told about the game, you lose. And you start over. So good luck. You start now. You're starting now. Good luck. Good luck. But at any point... Holy crap, we just got a raid. We just got a raid. That's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right. All right. We got we to gotta give a thank. That's a big one.
Can we give a round of applause to Bazagger, please? Just drop the raid on us. Give him a thank you. Give, give him a thank you. This is, this is big. I really appreciate it, man. I really appreciate it. This is, it means, it means a lot. Thank you so much. Oh, oh, getting those raids. <laughs> Why does it even tell me for one person? Stop, stop typing raids. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> it doesn't do, why does it tell me one? It's it's basically just announcing that you're here. It's like, yep, they're here. They've arrived. Now it's eight billion? One of my old backpacks. Koi boy, I swear. Forgot I attached tracking dots to these. What's in the bag? Alright, I'll check DMs for the essay here in a second. Wonder how many of these are scattered around the city. Ooh. Oh my god, I have to collect all of those? That would probably take like a minute. Oh my god, it's the menu from my first date. Wish I could have afforded someplace fancier. But she didn't seem to mind. Wait. Wait. You mean to tell me that Spider Man went on a date with Mary Jane and then he stole the menu? He, he stole the menu from the restaurant is a memento. That's the creepiest thing I've ever heard. Still there? Got a robbery a few blocks away. He's like, that was a really nice date. And he just slips. Spider cops on it. <laughs> slips the menu into his pants. He's like, I got to get this out of here. And imagine if she broke up with him like a week later, he would have been like, I never want to see this menu again. I hate it so much. He probably asked about keeping it. Next time you guys are at a restaurant, I want you to ask them if you could keep the menu and not have them look at you and be like, what the hell are you talking about? And you're like, please, this date went really well. Let me keep the menu. Hey, fellas. Oh, Spider-Man, shoot him! Oh, that was a sick flip. Guys, do you think that you could actually get away with robbing a store? Like, like I would never do it because I don't want to go to jail or get shot. But like, if you guys, do you guys think you could pull off a robbery, like a bank or a Burger King? Or the Burger King bank. Sounds kind of tool. A TV with a bill. Holy crap! He just ran over that guy. He just ran over his teammate. I love how you can whip the guns out of their hands. Please give eight billion. I would like the sting of losing it. I will gladly give you those coins if you don't give them to anybody. If, if you hoard the coins for yourself and gamble them and, you know, roll around in them like Scrooge McDuck, you can have as many coins as you want. But if you start sharing them, then, then that unleashes a fire of epic proportions. I'm going to repair the last Chinatown tower now. Dangerous, dangerous fire that I have to put out. Been doing a little thinking, Yuri. Policing's a young man's game. And Spider Cop, well, he's no spring chicken. Kingpin is in jail. As of today, Spider Cop is officially retired. Oh, thank God. I need a drink. We'll all drink tonight, Yuri. Drink to the memory of Spider Cop's tireless... Yuri? Yuri, you there? Sorry, Gone. Uh, guess the emotion of the moment overwhelmed her. 